it, it, it helps to have the off the shoulder thing going. Oh yes, yeah. and this, it's the, this. Oh my gosh. Changes everything. I'm just going to, it wasn't an interview, <laughs> just watch you do this. Yes, that's right. You wonder why black girls rock? Here you go. As you guys know, Tracy Ellis Ross, the daughter of Diana Ross, she starred as sexy single lady Joan Carroll uh, Clayton on the hit sitcom called Girlfriends, which a lot of us miss. You're still young and cute. Yeah. And since then, she has been keeping her TV family in check in her role as Dr. Rainbow Johnson on the critically acclaimed hit comedy series Blackish. Check it out. Hey, I'm not clueless here, all right? The twins are just still so little. And I'm not ready for them to think and see the world the way you do. I mean, come on. Jack still thinks that when you swallow a piece of gum, it grows a gum tree in your stomach. <laughs> gum tree? Yeah. Kids. <laughs> but it does take seven years for it to digest, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> yes! Love this show. Isn't it a good one? How? I mean, I mean because, I mean, here's this great family that, that addresses issues yeah but yet doesn't hit you over the head with it yeah you know the writing is fantastic and i think there's a way i think the fact that in essence at the core we are a multi-generational family character driven comedy yeah. so the focus is not on these issues we're dealing with mm -hmm. it's a family living in current times and so these are things that we run into mm -hmm. and so as a result i don't feel that it's heavy-handed and the focus is it because it's character driven it's it's not situational yeah so it's all about sort of how this family is dealing with what's happening in the world yeah. and how you raise kids in this day and age which is no easy fit and yeah and it's an ever-changing world and all of these things are coming up for all of us all of these big issues how to deal with the n-word um, mm -hmm. the sex talk all mm -hmm. of these kinds of things that you have to deal with with your kids which I know you're probably dealing with <laughs> when, when you were young and growing up I mean obviously you're super smart you could have done a lot of different things was showbiz the road that you always wanted to go down or did you have something else in mind that maybe you would like to a certain extent I went into fashion for a while mm -hmm. and I thought that was where I wanted to go mm -hmm. um, I could have gone the therapist teacher route very easily because yeah. that's an area that I was really drawn to but as I get older and I look back I really think that I'm a performer before I'm an actor mm -hmm. I did lip sync battle recently did you love it let me tell you something Wait, who, I know it sounds obvious give it but I'm I'm I really enjoy being on a stage with Mike. <laughs> really I'm just telling you Seriously? I mean it's like I was born to do it <laughs> anyway what was uh, your song what song did you pick I did Nicki Minaj super bass oh, wow. and then I did Pat Benatar's love is a battlefield and I full-on did choreography and it was incredible wait a minute who were you against uh, Anthony Anderson and I oh, kicked, I kicked goodbye I, I, goodbye I, I, I mean it. just you know he's really talented which is but. why I mean black girls rock yeah of course well. I mean th th <laughs> we knew this it's the 10th Hello. anniversary sixth year of your involvement yes um, it's an extraordinary organization that does more than this award show but what I love about the show is it's an opportunity for everyone to sort of see black women in our fullness and our culture doesn't always get to see the fullness of that mm -hmm. and so this is an award show that gives the younger generation an opportunity to see us in all our glory um, and we have amazing honorees this year Rihanna Shonda mm -hmm. Rhimes, what? Amanda Steinberg um, and um, the women who created the Black Lives Matter hashtag um, Gladys Knight wow. I mean Gladys on. is gonna yeah. be there uh, see, you just have to say Gladys Gladys is gonna <laughs> be there <laughs> It all happens right in that moment. All of a sudden, you sounded like two old Jewish ladies from Brooklyn. <laughs> I, 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 Gladys, Gladys is going to be there. Gonna be it's going to be fantastic. Gonna be you're going to fell. It's going to be great. The show is called Black Girls Rock. People are going to want to going to want to see it. They're going to have some coffee, watch the show, maybe have a little cheesecake. That's right. See Rihanna. Some, some kugel. Some kugel. It'll be cool. great. Cool. We're going to talk about how the Black Lives Matter. It's going to be fantastic. like a perfect day. It's good. There's a, my, my brandy's going to. What's not to like? What are you gonna want? Come what on! Do you want to please. see? Please! Oh, it's my favorite. Oh, it's my favorite oh, I'm, show. Oh, I'm, I'm felling here. I tell you. I'm spritzing. If there's anyone that wants no, to that's watch TV, that's the show you want to watch. That's the show. You know, what? Black Girls Rock. Yes. Tuesday, Tuesday night. B E T. B E T. That's right. We love you. We love. Hello, today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there, and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.